from Pakistan. You're Pakistan? Yes. Where are you? I'm in America. Why? Because I want to be here. Why? Because I choose to. Why? Because I choose to. I just what, what answered makes, you. What makes you choose what? here? Because I chose to be here. I can be anywhere yeah. I want. Why but not? You have a whole country. Yeah. That's getting messed up by this By religion. who? By Islam? No, no, no. Islam did not mess up Pakistan. Oh, okay. And Pakistan isn't and messed up, thank mess you very Persia, much. And it didn't mess Persians, up Persians messed up Persia. Mess up, Understand? Up, uh, no, it did Saudi not. Arabia, Islam did not. Islam and defended and rose. Egypt, the Arabian people were nothing. You're not listening. Rulers You're not listening. You're, You're not listening. Islam. You're not listening. You're That's not Islam. You don't read. Let me ask you something. Okay, let me ask you something. Let me ask I are you gonna Europe. listen? I know. I Why are you Europe? here? Because I hate, <laughs> I hate, you hate the what? vengeance. Uh -huh. What Islam has you're, done to my country. You're a hater, then. No, yeah, I hate. You're that a ideology. hater. Yeah. That well, ideology. Well, Iran isn't even run people. by Islam. You know ISIS. Is it? ISIS yeah, I know ISIS. Kills Who created ISIS? You did. Who created? I did. You, this ideology. I did. I did. This ideology I did? that separates. I created people. ISIS. This I ideology. created yes, ISIS. This one. Go this see what one. Donald Trump said that Hillary Clinton created ISIS and Obama created ISIS. Was there an ISIS before the U.S. invasion of Iraq? Yes, was there? Yes. It was You're an Al idiot. You are an idiot, sir. I'm, an idiot. I'm sorry. Go read a book and then come back. Yeah, there was ISIS. no ISIS. Al Qaeda separate ISIS, rules. Any other religion Al Qaeda. Other than okay. Islam? Was there Al Qaeda before okay. the U.S. funded back, them to fight you know, bring back in, in my, Afghanistan? Bring back the what happened in Afghanistan? Do you know what happens when Nigeria? Yes. Yes. Let me tell you. Let me tell you what kids? happened. Buku Haram is okay. a Western invention. Go Google well, it. Look invention. it up. Okay. Who, who okay, created the Taliban? Who created the Taliban? Who created the Taliban? Who created the Taliban? Huh? When the Russians invaded Afghanistan. Who funded them? That's what I thought. Walk your little doggy. The difference between cleanliness and danger to your children, right? Okay. How many cats do you know that have bit off their children's, their, their owner's children's heads? I don't know about that. Okay, can, I, can you answer no, my question? No, no. Um, I, Go ahead. I, I don't know of any. Okay, but, so, but so, no, so now, I, I now, now let, me, let me just finish. How question. many dogs okay. do you know or have you heard of that you've read about yeah. that have attacked their own ch owner's children? Oh, yeah. Right. Maybe, so, so, so you see the difference between cats and dogs? It's not just about yes. cleanliness, right? Yes, yes. There is an aspect of cleanliness, but there is also an aspect that a dog is created, has certain function in nature. Right. He's good at hunting, he's right. good at defending, he's good at uh, shepherding. So in Islam, for those reasons, you can keep dogs. Okay. But when you keep dogs in the house around children, yeah. where you expose them to danger, because a, God's, a dog's instinct is different from a yeah. cat. Yeah. A cat will never kill yeah, your right. child. Right? So you can keep a cat in the... Actually, uh, do you know of any cats killing uh, children? Maybe cats, cats... Have you ever heard of a no, 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 Have no. you ever heard of one? I'm trying to answer. Sure. Okay. Um, cats, when, when, when you have a newborn baby, mm -hmm. you want to keep cats away from them okay. because they'll go for soft parts. Okay. Yeah. So now, let yeah. me ask you the question. Yeah. Have you ever heard of anybody's cat killing their baby? Oh no, I'm not claiming... Okay. I'm not so, so the danger posed by dogs being yeah. in the house is much higher than that of cats, okay. right? Can I ask my original we... question now? Sure. And I have a question for you. So, no, I'm curious, and I don't, I don't know where this is going, but in the Hadith, mm -hmm. did they mention... Uh, so, okay, Go ahead. do they talk about keeping cats in the house in the Hadith? No. They don't? No. Okay, all right, fair enough. Okay. Um, uh, my... Okay, all right, Take enough. your time. Fair enough. Yeah. All right. Um, can I can I ask can I ask him about a verse or did you have one to ask? I have no questions. I'm just I'm just trying to save these guys. They're looking at a book of darkness and they're putting yeah. Jesus Christ in comparison to a book of darkness. Who's when he saw people stoning a girl said, "He who is without sin be the first one who." Throws so so let, let's talk about the Bible. Okay. You, you want to talk about the Bible? Instead of that, this would you like to talk terrible. about the Bible? Okay. This book. Can I ask my question? Would you Would that? you like to talk about the Bible? No, I don't. You don't? don't because about, you don't want to talk about it, right? I'm not talking about the Bible. I'm so talking you're talking about, about Jesus. How do you know about Jesus? From the Bible? No. How do you know about Jesus? No. Oral tradition. Which oral tradition? Who did you speak to to learn the oral tradition? Many people. Who? Many people. And who did they hear it from? Who did many, they hear it from? Many, many people. Let, let's see it chained back to Jesus. I didn't think do, so. Do, I didn't do, think so, yeah. Do, do you, Why do you want to waste you your time, bro? light or darkness? I believe there's light and darkness. And well, Allah I'm calls us towards the light. Allah okay. in the Quran. So book, Allah, can I finish? Book, you you yeah, see this? He's not listening. I'm I'd rather talk to you, but at no, least you yeah, listen. No, I'm listening you, to you. I'm Go sorry, ahead. I'm sorry. Can you give me your opinion? So uh, sure. on, on this uh, about the detailed explanation of all things. Sure. So whenever I read a sacred, a whole uh, a religious text, I'm never clear on how literally I should take a verse or how figuratively. 
Yeah. Right, let what's, me read. Your, what's your opinion on that? Book? Surat Yusuf, so there are certainly in their stories a lesson for those of understanding. Never was it the Quran and narration invented, nor a confirmation of what was before it. And a detailed explanation of all things in guidance and mercy for a people who believe. Excellent. So the Quran becomes the basis for all in development of sciences. Right? So it's not that Yeah. Can I speak to him? Yeah. So so what does that mean? Muslim scientists Reading the Quran developed astronomy. They developed the development of how the child develops in the womb. I'm sorry? Oh, yeah. Right? So, this means the Quran is a basics of all what is to be learned. It doesn't mean that, for example, how does aspirin work going to be in the Quran, right? But the development of medicine, the development of space travel, all of those things were in the basis in the Quran. Then, the pondering, which is called tadabbur, and research is upon the people to take the Quran from all different sciences, all different realms of life, how to run a society, how to develop a space programs, all of that would be the essence of it will be in the Quran and then you would develop from there. Okay, so then when you see a detailed explanation of all things, yes. you're not taking that literally, are you? We are, but, but what does that mean, all things? Yeah, that's, that's, that's what I'm asking you. So that's what I'm explaining. That? Yes, things. that means that all the different sciences that will develop, uh -huh. the essence of them will be from the Quran. Yes. Right. So, for example, algebra, right? Algebra was a Muslim, Musa al Karzimi. Who, go ahead. Let me digest what you said. Sure. The essence of all. So, that passage means the essence of all things is found in the Quran. Yes. Okay. I'm just trying to see if that's. 